this is a little behind the scenes at the Pebble Beach Food and Wine. This is when the audience loads in before a demonstration. If you can follow me, I'm going to show you this amazing state-of-the-art kitchen that Gen Air builds for these demos. Take a look at this. This is a girl's dream. It's a brand new Gen Air. But look how fabulous this is. They set up, in this case, Fabio, chef fan favorite from, from Top Chef. He's all set up with his demo. All the mise en place are ready to go for him to show his, I think he's calling it three minute gnocchi. And then as you can see, all the top of the line KitchenAid appliances. And I know this is what I need in my kitchen, an overhead mirror. So the whole family can enjoy when mommy's making dinner. I love being able to share behind the scenes at these really high caliber chef events and who better to spend a little behind the tent time behind with than, than Fabio Viviani. I still think of you as, as fan favorite from, from Top Chef. Is that something you, you, you want, you're trying to divest yourself of? No, you know, it's been a good experience for me. It's just there has been so much between the fan favorite and now that we can pick other scenarios. To All also right. Share. Tell me what, so what do you want our audience to know about what, what you are know, you doing and what can we look for? I would like, you know, everybody say, you know, Fabio, you know, that's a great uh, Italian, the Italian guy that was on Top Chef, not the fan favorite necessarily. Okay. Now, you know what, we, got, we, we just uh, got the number for my internet show, Ciao Ciao on Yahoo, it's the number one show on the web. Congratulations. 2012, we killed it. Uh, so you're, you're, you're taking advantage of all the platforms out there to keep this, this Italian chef alive. Correct. You know, it, it's good to get outside of the kitchen a little bit although I have five restaurants so I'm in the kitchen very often but with that said it's nice to branch out because people are expecting you to see not only in the kitchen but they want to know how you are how you dress uh, how Fabio you eat, Fabio so. you have to give the people what they want you do which is you that's a good outside that's of the good, kitchen it's true it is true and you know and the nice this is the people business so the nicer you're with people, the better it's going to be. Well, there's nobody nicer than Chef Fabio Viviani. And today, we're also going to get a look at your demo. Yes. So why don't you talk me through what you're going to be doing up there? You know, it's simple. Uh, kitchen and food in general is, has to be a headache scenario, headache-free scenario. And people make it headache friendly so they complicate things they right. get stuck in procedure so today we're gonna explain two Italian staple gnocchi and fresh pasta in less than five minutes so if you have fingers and a food processor you can make those two dishes in really like 45 seconds no no fancy no uh, no, no, no no machine no panza, to, no and then to needy, cut it and, no, and no. No, none of that everything it's easy headache free we are changing the game of cooking once you've done it once or twice and you understand the hula hoop, the hula hoop principle, and you realize that sticky pasta cannot be put through a food processor, but playable pasta can, you can make your fettuccine in no time. Fabio, do you remember your first gnocchi? I do, I remember my first gnocchi. My grandma made it um, two nights after I set her on fire when I was five years old. That's how I started to cook. Um, I love that. I it's always, is it, is it always the grandmother? It, it, it always seems to go to that. It does because I did set her on fire and it was a mistake. Uh, she I'm was, sure it was a mistake. It was. I was five years old, so I, I kind of uh, kind of made that happen. She, it was a bad story, which, by the way, it's the full story, untamed, untouched. It's in my book, Fabio's Italian Kitchen. I convinced my mom to release all our family recipe wow. in one collection. And she said, and I'm quoting, I'm only do that if I can release all the shit you do and you've done as a baby in the book. I love it. So that book. It's a memoir and a recipe everything, book. Everything you ever wanted to know about Fabio. <laughs> M minus and three story. It took three of them out. It was too much for America. Everything else, some funny, some bad, some will make you cry, some will make okay. you laugh. Let, let's there. just say stay tuned. The day is young with Fabio. Yes. Go get them out there. Thank you, Zuri. Bon Thank, Thank you. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Thank you, guys. I'll see you in a bit.